everyone, this is Wolfus here. Uh, another uh, edition of uh, War Robots. Uh, I just created a, uh, for those who are in my uh, chat rooms or in the clan, uh, please note that uh, I've created a Facebook group. Uh, and I've, uh, I've uh, put in the uh, clan message board the name of the group. And it's optional, but uh, if you want, uh, you can join it and uh, so we can better communicate with each other and uh, stuff like that. For those who are in the clan. Uh, anyways, uh, we're gonna do another gameplay. It's been a been a minute. Uh, here's my clan. USA Clan Wolfus, uh, Clan ID. And uh, let's do it. Put some music on. This is my general setup. Uh, I'm not a big spender. You get a screen pause and screenshot it if you want. And I have a different setup set up so I like to have a at least one long range and like two close range. These are my two uh, close range here. Uh, this one's my long range. Let's put some music on. cover. See what I'm doing? I'm using cover. I'm making sure that they're in there.
fun with a tight one of my own. as cover you see I was being tag team so I went around so uh, I'm not smack in the middle I used that building as a cover I was doing my part I don't know what people were, were doing on their part uh, I don't know how many kills I got though but uh, I felt that I was doing well let me uh, go ahead and do this uh, promotion here yeah Pac-Man whatever so anyways um, uh, you know, uh, the way I was maneuvering over that building it's very important because you're going to get Titan. And if you have a Titan that has a shield in front of it, well, your weakness is Choose your someone attacking you from the side or even worse, the back, because that's where your weakness is. Or champions. Oh, man. This is going to be great. Yeah, I'll see what I can get out of okay, be cool, be cool, be cool, be cool. The hell? Come on. I'm sorry about that, folks. There we go. Sorry about that. All right. Boom. Look at that. I got the highest kills. So I was doing my part. I got the highest kills on that squad. So what I was trying to say was, uh, when you have your titans, especially this one, this is the titan that I, that I was using. Okay, the Arthur. Okay, so when you activate your shields, which is in front, the side, like here, or the back, which is even worse, is your weakness. So when you're attacking someone from over here, and then over here, they're going to try to box you in. So you want to find cover. So that's what I did with that building. I, I the, the, uh, those two titans were attacking me from both sides, and, you know, I can only protect my front. I can't protect all my sides. I can't protect all around, only in the front right here when I activate my shields. So I went around, if you notice, and, and uh, had that building block my left side from that flying titan. So I could just focus on the regular titan, okay? Hold on. <clears throat> Oops. Sorry about that. I, mean, I wanted to show you. <clears throat> so you have this. And this titan right here. This is the titan that was, uh, I believe was in the air. Yeah, it was this one. The Ming. This one can fly. And uh, someday I might even get it. But um, I'm using the Arthur. Your base is Kid. That's, that's your base one. That's the one the game gives you. But I have the Arthur. And it's superior when you have a shield in front. So, um, you know, we lost that game. That's because my guys weren't doing their thing. I was doing my thing, uh, but it is what it is. 
And if you notice somewhere in the middle of that, that dude wasn't capturing the beacon. He wasn't holding the beacon. And when you have a when someone switches to their Titan, if you don't have a bot that can defeat a Titan, you have to switch to your Titan. I can't stress that enough. If you see a Titan on the map, if you don't have a bot that can take it on, you better damn well just switch to a Titan because uh, basically only a Titan can kill a Titan. That's essentially it. If you don't have a bot that can take it on, then only a Titan can kill a Titan. Now I have members in my clan that have bots that are so powerful that by itself they can take on like a normal Titan. Like the one that I had, uh, the author or the kid, which is your base uh, Titan that the game gives you. They can take it on no problem. Um, but if you don't have a bot that, uh, you don't have a setup like that, then only a Titan can take a Titan. When you see a Titan on the map, you gotta switch to your Titan, folks. If I had other members switch to their Titans, uh, like that other dude that was on the, my left side who was taking the be beacon, if the people on the right side on the respawn was switching to their Titans, because there was two of them, we could have taken them down very quickly and I could, um, instead of moving away from the beacon, I can reclaim the beacon because I can have two of my guys take on the kid, uh, titan. And then I could take on the, um, Ming titan that was flying, you see? So, anyways. That's it for now. Uh, that was, a uh, basic gameplay. I guess I could do one more. Why not, right? Well, let's do one more. Let's put the music back on. See if I can win one this time. See if I can invite some of my clients. Last time it was just a random invite. see if uh, the one in green is my member of my clan. The ones in blue are the ones that uh, are not in my clan, but just random invites to the squad. Okay, so this map is predominantly a long range, which is why I try to reserve a long range uh, bot. So my clan member is here.
the pedometer to support. I was pretty good as a support. So I used a long range and I'll show you the two bots that I was uh, using for that for that specific map. Nice, the hammer hey, came down on the bottom, but that's okay. I was predominantly focusing on uh, capturing map. Good job, Dragon. Good job. Put the music off so you guys can hear me talk. So I'm gonna say good, uh, good job to Dragon. This is a Dragon right here. Good job, man. Let me shout out. I'll give him a shout out. Great. Great. Uh, 
Okay, so uh, I'm gonna show you the bots that I was using. That was a dragon. Good job, man. Diamond League. All right, let's switch over. So the first one that I was using for that map for long range is this setup. Raven. Those are my weapons. Uh, give you my pilot. Really basic. I haven't really uh, upgraded. I need to upgrade. Some of the pro robot players will kind of uh, look down on this. But that being said, truth be told, uh, a little bit of recap history for those who don't know, uh, because people will forget. Uh, I was one. Of, uh, I'm one of the first. Uh, I was a beta player for this game for about six years ago or so. About four or six years ago, I forget when this game came out. This is back when it was called uh, Walking War Robots, and this is before they had clans or even chat rooms uh, or, or clans um, of any kind. You just had you you had to play solo and play random, and they only had a few bots. But when the official game came out, and it was they changed it from Walking War Robots to just War Robots. That's when they introduce uh, clans and uh, more robots and stuff like that. So um, I've been uh, as soon as they introduced clan, I was one of the first. I believe I'm the second American clan to ever be created. The first was a, a woman that I actually was in a chat room with, who came before me. She was the she was the one that notified me about the new updates that you could create clan. But from my understanding, she has since disbanded her clan and quit the game. So that makes me the oldest American clan in the entire game of War Robots. So it's a bit of a prestigious title. Although, uh, my original uh, account, uh, I had much more powerful robots. I basically had every single robot, every single weapon, and everything maxed out, upgraded. Um, I forgot to link my account, and hence, therefore, I lost my account. So this is my second account that I've had for, uh, for a couple of years. And because I've, I spent so much money on my original account, I just don't spend money anymore because I was really pissed. I spent so much money and I just forgot to uh, link my account. So when you get this game and download it, War Robots, for your mobile app, make sure you link your account to your Facebook and or Google. Don't make the same mistake uh, that I did, especially if you're going to spend money. But uh, so, you know, I don't I don't I don't uh, I basically spend what, maybe 20 every other month, maybe. But this is just a basic setup. I have uh, members who uh, are hardcore spenders. And of course, they they have uh, linked their account to their Facebook and or Google. So they're good. But, um, so anyways, that's reasons why I have a very basic setup. But anyways, here's the, uh, once again, the, uh, uh, bot that I was using for that map. It's a superior for long range. And as you can see from my performance, uh, it's very good at supporting. If you have someone who's a charger, who's, who's, uh, I call him a charger. That's someone who fights you, you know, face to face. Uh, a tanker, if you will. This is good for support, as I demonstrated. And also using cover, because this one has no shield. So you want to have cover. And especially attack uh, bots who are preoccupied of uh, attacking other bots. So that's... There you go. Show you my weapons. Okay. My light weapon. Now let me show you the secondary weapon to uh, capture the flag specifically. Or the second robot that I, I used was this one. Uh, this is my Ares. I didn't do too well. Uh, I didn't. I didn't utilize this well because for this you want something that's more close quarters, and there's a whole bunch of stuff to take cover behind. So when you activate your shield, you pop out, you shoot, and when your shield is about to uh, uh, to be depleted, you hide behind a uh, object again to take cover until you recharge. So that wasn't a good. Point. The third one that I was using was this. This is my Loki. It's got stealth. Uh, then when you act deactivate your st the stealth is permanent, by the way, and you move faster. So this is perfect for sneaking around while everyone's occupied, fighting and taking uh, uh beacon controls, as you demonstrated, uh, as I demonstrated uh, towards the end of that gameplay. This is what I was using. This is the stealth. So now when you activate stealth, people can target you, but they have to target you manually and shoot you. Uh, and you can still take on damage. Uh, but they can't ha they they're not capable of having a lock on target on you So the best way to utilize this specifically in that map that I just uh, was on was to make sure that you're either uphill or downhill Because if you're uphill or downhill you're you're uh, opposing the opposing squad bots They can't target you. You know, what I mean you have to be at an even playing field where they're right in front of you to shoot you So if I'm on top of a hill like you saw me that I was when I when I had that beacon 
and you saw those two bots that were in the bottom, they couldn't target me so long as I had the shield because I was up. I have to be, in other words, I have to be eye level for them to manually uh, target me and shoot me. Uh, but it's, it's because I had high ground and I had my shield, I knew they were not capable of shooting me. So I could just sit there and just uh, hold on to the beacon. And uh, while they're recharging, or if I feel like they were charging, uh, deactivate it and very quickly shoot my, my weapons at them. And it takes about just a few short seconds uh, for you to reactivate your shield. But unfortunately, I was dealing with someone who had a, an Ares, and I, I didn't pay attention to that. So, But I could have taken that guy on. I could have. Uh, he only had a little bit of life. But um, anyways, this was very effective at taking beacon control. So there you go. Those are the, my three rocks, uh, three robots. My but my two primary ones that I used that was effective was this, which was the last one, and then beginning for support for long range attack and uh, supporting my squad mates was this. There you go. All right, folks. This is Wolfus. Another edition of uh, War Robots gameplay. My clan here is USA Clan Wolfus, and uh, there you go. Another shout out to uh, Dragon who was uh, in my clan, working with me. All right, there you go. Until next time.